I think it's time I got back to... John! Where have you been? At the beach. Is that seaweed on your collar? I got a bit homesick. Started swimming back to Ireland. Till I remembered something I had to tell you. What was that? You're a bold lass, Veronique. Bollocks like brass boulders you have. And you're old enough to know your mind. I won't say otherwise. Is that your idea of an apology? If it'll do. Well, pleasure indeed, my petites. I have been saving this bottle for very special occasion. Sean, I did not know you were back. Aye. Just in time for happy hour. Or did you have another rare pleasure in mind? I am afraid we are short on glasses. I'll go dig one up. Enjoying the spoils of war, are we? Struggle must be going well. The resistance grows stronger every day. Last night we were contacted by another cell on the west side of the city. They want to join us. You trust these people? Not yet. But we cannot pass up the chance to forge an alliance. Actually, I was hoping you would look into it for me. I can see you're busy here. To reach the western district, one must pass through security checkpoints. My face is well known to the Nazis. Veronique offered to go in my place. <laughs> I'm sure she did. But I'll go just the same. I'll need transit papers. Santos can get forged travel documents. I'm sure you can work something out. Tell Veronique I'll take a rain check on that drink. I've seen you before, haven't I? The night we broke those legionnaires out of the German lockup? Yes, I was there. I was a captain in the Legion. Now the men call me Le Crochet. The hook, you can see why. The German jailer who took my hand fed it to his favorite dog. You're still alive and free. Yes, thanks to you. But some of my men were not so lucky. This German. He has a lot to answer for. I know what you mean. The German is here in Paris. I'm told he has a taste for the sort of flesh one finds in the red light district. He tours the alleyways at night with his bodyguards, feeding his deviant appetites. The working girls are terrified of him. We can't abide that sort of perversion in our lovely city now, can we? I'll take care of it. I want him to know why he is dying. Make sure he hears my name before he breathes his last.
to scrub away this old blood. Sure, interest you in some personal protection. Hoodlums and drunkards, just like home. Time to find the crowd that gave Crochet his hook. Yeah, 